Do dogs see humans as a strange type of fellow canine? Are they man's best friend because they think that we're related somehow? If a dog owner has to take up the role of being the pack leader, does that mean the dog is thinking that the owner is the alpha dog? Today, we're going to peer into the thoughts of our four-legged friend to figure out where we fit into their view. This is Dog Breed's FAQ channel. So, do dogs view humans as dogs? We're friends, companions, work associates, roommates, even part of the family as far as our dogs are concerned. Does this relationship make dogs assume that we're the same? Though we can't just ask them to give us their thoughts on the matter, most would argue that the answer is no. They don't think that we're a higher form of a dog. Dogs are not human level smart, but they're not oblivious either. Bearing that in mind, let's reverse roles a little bit to gain what things must be like from a dog's perspective. Do we think dogs are human? Some dogs out there can mimic a lot of things that they watch their owners do. We can also train our dogs to do things they wouldn't do naturally and conform to our human lifestyle to the best of their ability or willingness to be obedient. If they act like us in certain ways, does that mean that we consider dogs to be human? Hopefully you'd answer that as a no. Yes, most people take to their dogs as if they're children, especially those who get weak in the knees when those puppy dog eyes start begging for attention. But we all know that a dog is not a human, no matter what we teach them to do or what they try to impress us with or how we dress them. In a fraction of a second, all of us realize that a dog is a dog just using the sense of sight, let alone all of the other senses that could be used. Knowing behavior and even feelings doesn't dictate how we understand that a dog is a dog. Why do we assume that they would not know the difference between them and us? Are dogs smart enough to know the difference? In 2013, a French research team performed a study to determine if dogs could identify other, more diverse in appearance, breeds of dog as a fellow dog. Despite any of the variance in their appearances, sizes, colors, or weights, every dog recognized that they were among their own kind. What's most notable about this study is that it relied on sight rather than all other senses that dogs have at their disposal. Several dogs were chosen to perform this task, and one at a time was set in front of two screens. One screen had a picture of non-dog images or solid colors, and on the other screen would be pictures of different dogs. To make a long story short, if the dog approached the screen with the headshot of a dog, they'd get a treat. What makes this study important to our topic is that human faces were in the mix on the pictures used opposite the dog pictures. Every dog passed the test requirements, proving that they visually recognize their own kind when put to the test. This tells us that dogs can visually recognize another dog, despite all of the variances from breed to breed. Just like how we know that a human is a human and that a dog is a dog, all they had to do is look. Dogs have senses that are tuned better than our senses. Sure, we have abilities and different senses than dogs do, but when it comes to having the ability to identify something, dogs take the lead over humans. There are reasons why we employ dogs for different jobs like bomb sniffing, drug detection, and rescues. The truth is, we can't hold a candle compared to our canine friends in the smell department. Did you know that a dog's sense of smell can range between 10,000 and 100,000 times better than our own? Their sense of smell is far greater than ours, picking up on things that we'd remain oblivious to. It only stands to reason that a dog can notice an enormous difference between humans and other dogs just by our differences in smell. Do dogs think of themselves as being human? The real answer to this question is, who knows? Some people would swear that their dog thinks that they're human due to their behavior. Some dogs try to do what they see their owners doing, trying to take a bite out of our human way of life to some degree. We've all either had or have known someone who's had a dog that doesn't just think they're human, but behaves like they're head of the household. Yes, there are some real characters out there. But this behavior might not be due to them thinking that they're human, but simply just wanting to do some of the things we do and enjoy some of the things that we do. Do dogs even consider these kinds of things? All we need to do is observe a dog passively to know that dogs do broadly categorize between friend, foe, food, and mate. 
it's a typical human thing to make the world more complex than that. Again, we can't ask our dogs and get a firm answer. But is there any reason to assume that dogs think in the terms we've been discussing? Probably not. So, what do you think? Do dogs view humans as other dogs? Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. And also, if you've ever had a dog that thinks you might be a canine. And please don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel. Thanks for watching.